Okay, I'm Matthew Miller. I work for Red Hat and I am the Fedora project leader. My name is Jonathan Dieter. I am a system administrator for a school in Beirut, Lebanon. My name is Shimon Tro. I work for Red Hat for Fedora QA team. And yeah, I am a quality engineer. All right, my name is Mike DiPaolo. I contribute to Fedora in my free time. I'm a packager and ambassador. I'm also contributing a little bit to modularity and to diversity. Okay, so I'm Yona, uh, and uh, I'm part uh, of the Albanian uh, local community uh, because I come from Albania. Uh, so my name is Praveen Satpute. I'm from India. Um, so I'm uh, Mike McGrath. I work for the platform engineering team uh, as a manager. So I'm Ralph Bean, and uh, I have been coming to Flock for five or six years now. I used to work on the Fedora engineering team at Red Hat, and so it was my full-time job to work on Fedora and come to Flock and work with the community. Uh, so my name is Kanika, and I'm from India. Uh, I've been contributing to Fedora for two years now. Well, my name is Justin Flory. I've been a contributor to Fedora since November 2015 or so. His name is Ricky Elrod. Uh, I am on the Fedora engineering team at Red Hat. My name is Brian Exelbeard. I work for Red Hat as the Fedora Community Action and Impact Coordinator. There, uh, basically, there's a technology, technology side and a people side, and I think they're both very strong. I think Fedora, you know, we do really try and follow the leading edge of, of open source technology and uh, commitment to the open source part of that. And uh, it's not just, uh, it's not just that, that it's the bleeding edge, but we try to make sure we're following the leading edge of it, the exciting stuff, but also getting it to people in a useful way. So I think that's appealing. It's a kind of fun stuff to work on at the operating system level. So that that's neat. But also, this is a really amazing group of people, uh, and you know we've got you know, thousands of people who contribute uh, every year, um, you know, two, three thousand people to some level, and a core group of you know maybe four or five hundred people who are working every week on the project. Uh, and they're really great, generous people who have a real passion for the things we're working on. So I think that's pretty appealing too. It's fun to. I happily install most of the, any of the non-violent games in the Fedora repository are on our systems. And I'm like, have at it. Uh, the major part of Fedora is what I love about it is it's a bleeding edge. So I get the latest and the greatest of whatever that I want. So be it building bleeding edge stuff on IoT or be it big data. I have whatever tools that I require in ca to make sure my project is up and running. One of the things that I think is critical about Fedora that we are doing a better and better job messaging on is the Fedora community is way more than the production of the operating system. There's a lot of things to do and you can get involved in them. You know, there isn't like territorialism like you can't contribute to this component, only we contribute to this component. I think Fedora values a contributor. The thing that I think is really important about Fedora is we provide a facility for people to do what they want to do and they can get a lot of support from their fellow community members because we bring the right kinds of people together. Um, and I think the, the, the amazing thing for me is not just how many old faces I still see that are here, uh, but how many new faces I see and uh, how important it is to the community to get people involved and, and get out of their way. And I think there's not just that common sense of shared purpose towards building Fedora, the operating system and the distribution and making sure that our users are are happy but there's this short there's a shared understanding that uh, we're all people we're all flawed we all have something to bring to the table and so let's let's come and talk and and figure out you know what needs to happen what we can do and uh, you know everybody sees everybody else as important I, I think it's a, a very unique uh, a very unique experience everybody's kind of at the same level here and it's great the community by far um, I mean the people are the people I work with are, are some of the smartest people I know. Um, they're very resourceful. They're they're nice. I mean, I just I can't say enough about it. I just I love the community. It's it's like a family. Right? Fedora, I will say, uh, like anyone who is coming to the Fedora, so he will not feel that uh, there is not for him anything. So there is for everyone there is something in Fedora. So it's uh, it's it's passionate uh, but very friendly. And uh, uh, you see that especially at Flock. I mean, it's a really, a really tight-knit group of people that like working together and love working on what they work on. Uh, and it's a fun place to be. It's, it's what... I could easily see how passionate people were, not just about 
the work that they were doing, but also about supporting each other as like an empowering and inclusive community to build better software together. Let's say the community is one of the main reasons why I'm still part of it, uh, because they are really friendly, they are, they are really uh, friendly to the newcomers especially, so you feel really welcome at the community. Uh, because you know, when you go uh, to, a to a new community and you want to be part of it, first of all you are afraid that someone might say, okay, but you don't know this question. But not at all. They will be really fr friendly with you. They they will support you uh, for everything that you might need, and they will show you even the right direction where to go uh, and which teams you can be part. Large community of people who kind of use open source as an excuse to change the world, which that's an easy thing to say. But we do it a lot through non-code contributions. We have a huge outreach program. We have huge marketing opportunities, writing opportunities. There's ways for people to become involved in the ideals of open source, even if they choose not to actually commit a line of what we as engineers would call source.